Exclusive. Welcome back to Incoming Channel. So today I have a super exciting fragrance. This is the Candied Lychee by The Seven Virtues. I was really, really excited for this fragrance when I saw it because the promotion pictures were so pretty with like the um, the Candied Lychee and like just like the candy and the gummy, not gummy bears, but it was like gummy candies or whatever, like the sour candies and I love sour candy. Just the bottle, the packaging in general, this is like what the marketing was giving. Um, and yeah, I was really, really, really excited for this one whenever I saw it. So, I did buy the travel. Um, I do have some thoughts as well. Um, I'm going to pop up a picture here of the notes. Um, but the notes have kind of been like everywhere because Sephora was saying this was like rose, vanilla, and lychee. But then this fragrance also had notes of like jelly beans. There's some geranium. There was some crystalled amber. So, I'll be sure to put like the correct full notes because I want to list... The correct ones because i know it's just not that but i know there's peony in there for sure um so yeah when i saw that i was really excited and i do have some thoughts so i'm gonna go ahead and spray this one on the back of my hand let's see yeah so when you first spray this one i get hit with like the prettiest sugary lychee candy smell with slight florals in the back so i am still picking up on the peony already but there is just something very sweet sugary sour ish in the opening and really just pretty really fruity yeah i feel like i'm getting like a sour candy vibe almost like a jelly bean i feel like i am getting hints of jelly bean in this one but really pretty almost something like a watermelon i don't know if there is watermelon or strawberry in here but this one really honestly when i first first sprayed this one because i was working and i had to do this meeting and i was like i'm even though i work from home i like to spray myself so i was like let me spray this just to see how i feel about it while i'm working and see what it's giving you know all the good stuff this one i automatically thought of i automatically thought of the rose era fragrance from sniff this one has more heavy rose in it so not the mid of this fragrance or like the clean aspect of it but like the opening of this reminded me of it with that like strawberry this has a really pretty strawberry type of vibe to it um so it almost reminded me of this fragrance they're not identical or anything it was just something that popped in my head i was like oh rose air because this one has like a really pretty strawberry type of scent to it i don't know it's just i feel like right here i'm getting more of the rose but in the opening i get a really pretty strawberry smell and i feel like i'm getting something yeah like watermelon candies or strawberry candies with like a sugary sour type of vibe in the opening very like sugary sour candy very the name candy lychee like this is very candied um so yeah really pretty then as it dries down a little bit you get into that peony i get the floral vibe um and it's really really pretty honestly like i really like this and i feel like it is pretty for like a spring summer vibe but honestly i don't mind using this now i feel like if i had to kind of say this scent was in like a family of any of the most recent scents i've tried i would say like it's in that like fresh floral fruity vibe which is similar to kind of like deer sky like these are two fragrances that i feel like would be i don't even have deer sky in here because it's in my bathroom but that one is very like fruity floral fresh i feel like that's the same with this one you just get something a little bit more sour sugary candied like in the opening so yeah this one claims to last a very long time like i feel like they said it was like over 24 hours it was supposed to last which that's a really big claim but i feel like when i sprayed it it lasted a good amount of time but it didn't last 24 hours so i don't maybe they're referring to clothes because a lot of fragrances do last longer on clothes so if you do spray stuff on your clothes you're gonna have better longevity but i do feel like this one did last a good amount of time and i did enjoy it so yeah i'm getting into the florals now so if i were to say is this one more floral or more fruity i would say this is more fruity than floral at least for me i feel like the florals are there but they're kind of like watery florals if that makes sense and then yeah i just really like the opening of this though like the dry down is good too but i really wish that that like sugary because even now it's settling down into like a calm nice little scent 
but I'm losing like that sugary watermelon like candy vibe I really actually liked that in this one so I wish that lasted just a little bit longer but I do really like the scent nonetheless so if you were interested in this I would say yes it is a cup it is full bottle worthy I wouldn't mind a full bottle of this um yeah, I do just wish though, like I said, that opening. Let me spray one more time. Yeah, I really like the opening of this. Like the opening does it for me with that lychee. Ooh, I just got it on my hand. But the lychee, the sugary watermelon candy type of vibe is just so pretty and fresh. Like it's not even just like, oh, this is sugary candy watermelon. And it's like just so immature it is just very pretty feminine fun outgoing type of girl like it's giving just a pretty girl vibe like you're just pretty put together the florals come through and they're very like just pretty and fresh but you do have like this sweet sourness also to you like a little fizziness almost like have you ever pictured like the candy like candy sour candy and you can see the sugars on there and it just literally makes your mouth water like it's fizzy sour watermelon very fruity and yeah so i do like this one there's not really too much to think about with this one it's not a hard fragrance it's an easy reach easy throw on errands like you don't have to think about this when you're putting this one on because it's like it's just pretty it settles pretty fast like i'm already like i'm saying getting to the florals in this um i would say i may get a little bit of amber out of this but for sure i do get also like a jelly bean vibe because you do just get something very candied like so this is fun this isn't candied like vanilla candy rock sugar like that's not candy but it's very like bubble gummy type of candy this is very candied candy so i did try the kayali's eden um sparkling lychee it smelled like straight gummy bears on me personally so i did like it but it wasn't just something that i wanted wanted like i wanted the scent at one point i was literally like i think i'll just buy a full bottle but then I changed my mind because I was like, it doesn't last that long. And on me, I just get a lot of gummy bears, which is cute, but it's not personally what I want all the time. I know there is that dupe from Paris Corner. I was thinking about buying that. If you guys try to let me know. This one, I think would be more full bottle worthy because I'm getting something more than just that sweetness. That In that opening, you're also getting the florals. You're getting something a little bit, yeah it makes sense like a crystal amber because it is very just like a sparkling fun scent so very lighthearted. like any i feel like any age could wear this i mean i i don't know if older older women would want to smell like that watermelon candy that watermelon candy type of smell but then again it is just still really fun and just i don't know like i feel like if you smell this you're like oh she's fun she's cute you know she's just doing her minding her business um this is just a girly girl scents um and i believe this one is supposed to it's best for positive vibes and feeling flirty and boosting your energy and i do feel like this one does kind of boost your vibe kind of make you feel a little bit better could be slightly flirt this could be slightly flirty not date night flirty not you know that type of vibe this is just like fun and cute and like lighthearted vibes but it's not giving like sexy flirty or like you know seductive flirty it's more just like innocent you're not even trying to flirt type of vibes like you're just there pretty so yeah but it does dry down pretty fast to something light even though it does kind of last it's not something that like just stays as potent as the initial spray on me at least maybe i need to spray more and like spray all over i feel like this one will be one that i need to spray so that's why i probably would need a full bottle of this but I don't know if I would want a full bottle right now. I am someone that likes to go along with the seasons. So with this one for sure, I do feel like spring and summer. I mean, you could transition with this into like the early fall times, like getting into fall right now, it's early September. That's pretty for this, but I feel like I would have really enjoyed this in like the spring and summer. But yeah, it is a like, I really do like this scent. Is it a love? Mm. I think it's a strong like it's a strong like because i like the opening more than the dry down but it's not that i hate the dry down in any sense or that i you know one is just worse than the other i just feel like i enjoy the opening a lot more and wish it lasted longer because if that opening lasted longer on my skin i would love it so maybe it'll last longer on clothes i will try to spray this on my clothes i am about to do 
a whole Victoria's Secret haul in just a second. So I'm not going to spray this all over my clothes because I have like five cents to try from there. But I will keep on testing this one out and include it in like a trying... I will include this in like a update video for this fragrance where I'll spray it all over me, get a full little wear test moment going. But as of now, it is a like and it is kind of similar to the Rose Era fragrance from Sniff to me in the opening. Because you just get something very like sweet, juicy. Yeah, this fragrance is juicy to me. Um, and just yeah, pretty sweet, ripe, sour type of vibe. Um, yeah, so really nice do like it like i said it's it's not much to think about it's not hard it's very simple go to easy pull fragrance and yeah i feel like if you like these type of notes if you like lychee if you like fruity if you like floral if you like fresh this could be a good scent for you and i recommend it so if you want something fun, fun flirty a little bit you know sweet outgoing then i would definitely recommend to give candy lychee by virtue seven virtues a try because you may actually really like this more than any of the other lychee scents you've tried this one's a bit sweeter um even in comparison to like the nest rose lychee one that one's more heavy on the florals to me this one is definitely more just on the fun sugary candy lychee fruity vibe um but then you also just get like a light floral vibe in the background with some amber and some jelly beans so definitely a cop definitely look into it if you're interested i would recommend and I would love to hear how you guys feel about this fragrance down below. If you tried it, how are you feeling? What are your thoughts? I would love to know all that good stuff in the comment sections down below. And until then, you have to catch my next one. So, bye.